Hey guys, Carolina Rippers back with another video for you. So today we've got uh, a new product. Well, a new product for us to open. It's another rip from our buddy Andrew. So Andrew, of course, sends us some boxes to open from time to time. He likes to kind of mix things up a little bit with different products, especially stuff we haven't seen. Uh, and so this is two very cool products that I have not seen. I, I do know what the call of the captain is. Um, I kind of know what the Mystery 10 is, but I didn't realize they had baseball. So these are both baseball products. The Mystery 10 is something that was put together uh, by, is it Excel? No, MJ Holding. So MJ Holding is one of the one of the suppliers for Target and Walmart. I can't remember which one. I think, I think they're Walmart, if I'm not mistaken. And, and they came out with these Mystery 10s. If you've seen the football version, they had the, the color burst pattern on the front of the, the football ones. They were very popular. People were hitting case hits out of those like crazy. So he sent one of these, four sealed packs and one mystery pack. Now it says, look for hot boxes containing five hobby packs. That's kind of crazy. Cause this just says hobby packs, fat packs and value packs, which this thing's pretty heavy compared to the football ones. This is pretty heavy. Now this one is Call of the Captain. This is a special tops product that is specifically cards for Derek Jeter. Um, I was looking on here. I can't see how many are here. It does say top at, Tops X Derek Jeter. Um, but it does talk about limited release of, uh, let's see, relic subset containing Jeter's career march to 3,000 hits. So I'm not sure exactly what's going to be in here. I, I would expect it's going to be pretty cool though. So let's get to ripping. We're going to have a bunch of these videos um, for the holiday season that Andrew sent us some stuff. So let's do it. So this is kind of, it's kind of like a personal rip almost, except instead of us having them in stock and, and him buying them from us, he sends them to us. And then we we uh, sleeve them up and send everything back. All right, so let's see what Andrew got in his pack here. All right, so I don't think we got hobby stuff. So the first thing is going to be a 2021, I think, Prism uh, multi-pack. And then we got, oh my goodness, stuff like from the front of the box here. So Tops flagship, but this looks, is it Japanese? I don't know. Maybe these are some packs that are specifically sent to, um, obviously this is Asian writing, but I think they send some of this stuff to Japan, if I'm not mistaken. So that's cool. Allen and Ginter 2022. This is, I'm going to guess a blaster pack. Uh, Top series two, 16 cards. And then four cards in the top scrum. I wish there was a way to tell. I mean, obviously, it says you can you can get hobby packs or retail, but a lot of these there's no really good way for me to tell what's what. And top scrum. This is the first year of the platinum anniversary top scrum. So very cool either way. I mean, no matter what comes out of here, this is a very cool idea by MJ Holding to put together because you get a nice little tin with it as well. All right, so let's do. Do the Allen and Ginter first. Again, I have no idea how to tell if this is going to be hobby or retail. All right. Uh, is it? What's his first name? Landon Donovan. Goodness. Soccer player. Tom Flavin. Jason Veritek. And how about that? Otani. 2021 AL MVP banner season. That's cool. Definitely a good one for you, Andrew. And then Yates, Field Yates, nice on the mini, and Johnny Bench on the carpet back. So Allen and Ginter is a pretty difficult product to get something good out of. So I guess this is Series Two, Tops Baseball, thick pack of cards. This is probably why the, this and this are the two big ones making that thing so heavy. Rowan T. Contreras, Jonathan India, Delonte Wade, German Marquez, Kente Maeda, Josh Lowe, rookie Kevin Plowicki, Roman Quinn, Jacob Robson, and then a foil of Joe Adele Future Stars. That's pretty cool. Check this out. Stars of the MLB, Trey Murphy. Nice foil there. Goldschmidt, Willie Adams, O'Neill Cruz, rookie. One of the better rookies out of that set for sure. Dylan Cease and Chris Paddock. Interesting. Let's do the uh, Tops 
Asia edition. Let's see what it says on here. SoftBank Hawks. Okay, so these are the Asian uh, players as well, Asian teams. That's cool. Carter Stewart. These names are really small. Kende Jin. Tatsumi Masuda. Yudei Furukawa. That's a rookie. Got the little rookie shield down there. Seiya Inkui. Aroki Shumachi. Sumaki. I don't know how to pronounce these correctly. Haruki Nishikawa. Seiya Matsubara. Takumi Oshiro. Naoto Chino. Yashuri Ogawa. Now, are you guys enjoying this? Me trying to pronounce these names? I'm probably butchering this. Shun Namiki. Ooh, we have a horizontal. Yuki Mishi. And Takuya. Takuya Kinoshita. Okay. Wow. Don't ever do that to me again, Andrew. <laughs> that, I, I think I did okay. I Honestly, I think I did better with that than I have done in the past on some of the soccer cards. Where it's like 20 different countries, you know? They're like... You just can't even get in the mindset of what it might be because different different countries pronounce letter combinations differently. So it's so difficult. All right, so 2021. It says it right there, even though I was I was like, I think it's 21. I honestly didn't even see it. Prism. It huh? It says it right there. You it's should. right there. Look. Yeah, Cole's acting like he was even looking. So I saw it. I saw it. All right, here we go. Trevor Story. I like this design of Prism. Oh, wow. Look at the centering on that thing. Yeah, I don't know, like that. The door. Blake Snell. Alec Manoa, rookie. And we got Corbin Burns. Every time I hear Burns, I just think of the Simpsons. George Springer. Jonah Heim, rookie. Jose Abreu. Cattell Marte, fearless. We got some silvers. Oh, Nelly Cruz, fearless silver, and Trevor Rogers, silver rookie. Fireworks in the back is Charlie Blackman. Not bad. Oh, the bonus pack is this should be red, white, and blue, I would imagine. Now, in this set, the card that's on the back of this is not as rare, but if it was in football, wow, you get a lot of these. There's six cards in here. I thought there were only three normally. Jose Barrios, Pudge Rodriguez, Alex Bregman, Robin Yount. That's a rookie. There we go. Brayden, Brady Singer. And look at this. Oh, stained glass Mike Trout on the tricolor. The, the red, white, and blue. That's pretty cool, actually. What do you think of that, Cole? It's a very clean card, too, Andrew. That's nice. Like I said, stained glass in the other prisms is a case hit. It is not in baseball because that would be a monstrous card. And now, the Latinum, Top Chrome Platinum. These, the, the weird part about these when you're opening a hobby box is they all have this uh, fake auto, but the real auto is replacing it, and sometimes sometimes you miss it. Phil Negro, Lucas Giolito, Carlos Hernandez, rookie, and Juan Soto. Let's see if that would be so cool if that was a real auto. All right, so there you go. The uh, Those tens are pretty cool. And like I said, in the football, there was a lot of case hits. We didn't really hit a case hit, unfortunately, but still a very cool rip. Now let's check out this Derek Jeter, Call of the Captain. Oh, jeez. That's thick wrapping on their tops. Yes. All right. Let's see. So it's just going to be one little pack. Little pack. Cool box, though. I'll send you the box back, Andrew, because this is a cool box. I mean, I'm going to send you that 10 as well. Very, very cool. Let's see what we've got in here. Oh, there's a lot of cards. I'm thinking it might be like a low card count. Oh, it's not just Jeter. Okay. Let's do this. So, Mike Trout. It's a nice looking set. Very basic, but uh, I like that. I always like the clean. It's gloss finish. All of the captain, Mike Trout, Trey Turner, Pedro Martinez, Shohei, 
very cool. I'm actually going to sleeve some of these because I have no idea how rare these are. I don't think there's a billion. Sander Bogarts, Max Scherzer, Juan Soto, Tatis. We have a green. Jazz Chisholm on the green. These numbered. They are out of 75. Cool. So Jazz Chisholm green out of 75. Max Scherzer. That one's out of 99 with the Mets there. And it's really nice that this is a Topps product, so it is uh, licensed. Then you've got your Derek Jeter. This may feel a little bit thicker. You might have to put this in 55. So. Derek Jeter. There. Oh, geez. Look at this. This is uh, one of Derek Jeter's rookie, reproduced rookie from 92. That's really cool. Uh, so this is cool. So it's it's I guess they're all reproduced Jeter cards. This is funny. What's the back of that say? Uh, is this an error or something, Andrew? This is bugging me. It says, "Congratulations, you received an autographed reprint." Yeah, this one says it too. But it's not autographed. This one's not either. Are they supposed to be? Auto I mean, that would make this a really expensive box of cards if they were supposed to be autographed. If they're supposed to be autographed, you got hosed because. None of these are autographed. Maybe that's just a misprint. I mean, I get that they're reprinted. That's really cool. I like the cards. They're very nice. And then on the last card here is one of the relics it was talking about. Game used memorabilia. Well, it's uh, this is always pissed. Oh, oh, gosh, I said a bad word. This ticks me off about tops. Why do you call it game used memorabilia and then say item is not from any specific game? Meaning, it is game used, but you don't know what game it's from? Is that what that means? Pretty much. Okay. Because I was like, why do you say game used and then say it's not from a specific game? Then how do you know? I think it should be from this specific game. And maybe it is, but his 2500 hit is what this is commemorating. You have received a Captain's Quest Relic card, and that's numbered out of 25. That's pretty cool. These are very cool. I really like that set, Andrew. Thanks for sharing that. Very, very cool. Uh, but yeah, so there you go, guys. A bunch of different stuff. This is a really neat set to do uh, around Derek Jeter. You know what would be cool is to get these uh, graded by Arena Club, since that's Derek Jeter's grading company. Yeah. Pretty, be a pretty cool thing to do. Is that going 100? I was going to give you the relic sometime today, and then I'll show it to you again. Oh, here we go. So yeah, very cool stuff. So thank you very much, Andrew. Appreciate that. Another another one of Andrew's personal rips for you guys. Really nice thing that he does to share this, uh, you know, lets us open them for him, but also to share it with you guys. So y'all come back and see us again. Make sure you drop a like on this video. Subscribe to the channel so that you don't miss any of our, our uh, videos. We're going to have plenty coming up with the holiday season. We're going to have a ton of videos. So make sure you come back and see us. Have a great holiday, and we will see you again soon, guys.